The advantages of using our, our online website for scheduling the appointments are A, you can go in and create your own username and password. Uh, once you have created your own username and password, you can schedule an appointment. Um, and once you come in for your first appointment, from that time forward, you'll be able to review all of your service history, uh, again, from that point forward. You would never have to worry about remembering which, which service interval is next or what maintenance is due because it will keep track of your mileage with each visit uh, it's updated and you'll be able to just go online and review what's needed. Um, you'd also be able to review you know, the cost of the services that are needed. Um, you would also have 24 hour uh, accessibility to the website so if you realize at midnight that you need to schedule an appointment uh, you'd be able to go on and do that. It's also real time, so at midnight you would actually be viewing our schedule for the following day if that's what you chose to do. And uh, you'd be able to go online, schedule it if you see that we only have one appointment scheduled for 10 o'clock, but we have seven for 10.15, then you may want to go ahead and schedule it for 10 o'clock. And um, again, it's all real time. Aside from that, you'd be able to view the service specials uh, any, any coupons that are out there. You could also go online and view parts specials. You could go online and order parts. Uh, you could go online and look at and order accessories for your vehicles. And that comes, <clears throat> the accessories on the website, um, they have pictures of all the accessories so you would know that you're getting what you want. Um, you could also view the specials for our Toyota Rent-A-Car. You can view the rates for that. You can reserve uh, a rental car if you wanted to go out for the weekend, make sure that that's reserved for you already. Um, there are numerous, numerous things that you can do with the online website. And once you are at the website of Scott Clark's Toyota City, you will select Parts and Service, and from there you will select Service Appointment from the drop-down menu. If you've already used our online website, then you should already have a username and password. You would just enter that here and continue. If you're new to the website, you would select your make, model, and the year of the vehicle. Uh, Toyota is already selected. So for the model, we will use 2007 RAV4. So we'll select the RAV4 here. And the 2007 here. And then we need to select the trim. If you do not know the trim of the vehicle, you would just select I don't know, and it'll It'll pull up a generated base model. If you do know the trim, select that and it'll give you a little bit more accurate information. Select the driving condition, which there's only one option, which is normal. And then it'll ask for the approximate mileage, and it's just that, approximate mileage. It does not need to be nearly exact, just somewhere within 5,000 miles. After you put in the mileage, you need to select whether you need the routine maintenance, which is the scheduled service intervals. They're every 5,000 miles. Uh, if you have a certain concern, a noise, or a feel of the vehicle, you would select repair. If you're not sure what you need to select, you would just select not sure. Uh, you would hit tell us more and you'll enter a brief description of what's going on. And then someone will contact you to further assist you in scheduling the appointment. We are going to schedule routine maintenance today. And because we put in 57,000 miles, it rounded up to 60,000 miles. You have two choices. You have the 60,000 mile factory required, which is what the manufacturer recommends to maintain the longevity of the vehicle. You have the 60,000 mile factory plus, uh, which is the factory required, with a few additional items. You can view these items by selecting View Full Details, and you can also compare the two, the Factory Required and the Factory Plus. If you need to add an additional service, or if you would like to remove a service, you would just click on Individual Services, and from there you can add other things. Uh, one that is very common is the North, North Carolina State Inspection. You would select the state inspection and then select continue. And you'll see here that both of them are, are listed under selected services. The 60,000 mile factory required and the North Carolina state inspection. 
If you need to add anything else, you would do so at this time. Otherwise, select search availability. And from this point, you would need to select the, your mode of transportation um, if you're going to drop the vehicle off and return later to pick it up, if you would like to wait in the service department, or if you'd like to rent a Toyota uh, for the day, select that. We're going to select wait in the service department. And then you would also need to select a service advisor. Now, if you've been here before, then you would have a service advisor who you normally see, and you'd be able to select them at this time. If not, you could select any, and it will, the computer will just generate uh, the next available service advisor for you to see. Once everything is selected, you would click on Search Availability, and this will generate a list of the days and times available. Uh, you can click on View Calendar over here in the right-hand corner if you would like to schedule something three or four weeks out. You can click on the forward arrow if you would like to schedule something for the following week or you can select any of the days listed here which are for this week. So we will choose Thursday, July 14th at 3.30 p.m. And then you select continue. At this time, if you are a new customer and you have not registered, it will ask you to do so in order to reserve the appointment. So you click OK you would need to then click on register and you would need to make sure that you fill in all of the fields with the red asterisk those are the most important fields um, to have complete and it will not let you go any further if they're not complete once that is finished you select register and that will give you your confirmation code it'll also give you the option of selecting customer callback um, at that time, if you need to have a call back, you would enter the reason why, if you have a question, if you have a concern, and one of the 14 service advisors will return your call as soon as they receive the message. Well, thanks for watching this video. We hope it has been very informative for you, and we can't wait to see you at your next Scott Clark Toyota service appointment.